Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. You probably can't see me, I'm right behind. <laughs> I'll be doing some, uh, I'll be doing today a haul for you guys, hopefully you can hear me. Um, and yes, I'll be doing all items that I've been, um, talk this back a bit so you can see the stuff there now. Um, I've been gifted a lot of things to this month purely because it's my been my birthday and um, so I've got a lot of gifts from family and friends which was really nice and some things have some um, items have been sent to me by PR slash brands or a bit, mostly items have been bought but um, I thought I'd show you that's not even all of it but um, quickly I would do a close-ups and stuff like around here so you'll see anyway um, hello uh, firstly this is this brand called S Welder. The Australian, no, Melbourne Australian brand. They make quirky and um, really retro vintage style um, brooches. And I found um, this is uh, the brand gifted me this. And funny enough, they the brand. Um, sorry, I should stop doing that. There you go. So she, the brand actually gifted me this. So and uh, funny enough, they reposted my photo on Instagram. Um, of me showing this and wore this with red lipstick like really cute day kind of brooch i love brooches i think they're really cool i just gotta be careful about that um especially this one this one spoke to me i just found that she's really cute in french and i love french you know parisian style so i got that uh, that's on the brand um my sister bought me this for my birthday this is another brooch you can see on the back it's from love beta oh um, Levitza. Um, it's costume jewelry, but you can't really tell. Look at the thick that is. It's gorgeous, like really beautiful. Something for the night. I love brooches. I can find so many ways to wear them. Um, so I'm going to do a lookbook with how to start just an outfit with a brooch. So if you're interested in that, let me know. Please comment below and tell me what you tell me what you would like to see. I'm happy to do one. I actually really wanted to do one. That's one of the reasons why I wanted to do YouTube was to do like some lookbooks as well you know how beautiful is that my sister's got good taste she knows me very well she got me that costume jewelry like i said gorgeous that in the bestie got me these they're like dupes of bulgari the stud earrings oops <laughs> thought i'd do this because my nails are done properly but anyway so they're great dupes of bulgari so they're really cute for every day. I wear these every day, really. But I love slotted earrings. Um, I find them, yeah, just simple, easy. I've got a short neck, so I find um, slotted earrings much better than danglings and hoops. I used to wear them back in the day when I was a bit younger, but when I was a teenager. But, yeah, I find studs much easier, more classy, elegant. Tie up your hair, they look good. Put your hair down, they look good. Yeah, bigger the better. If it's at night, especially, heaps of bling, but this is great for every day. Just give me those. Now, um, to make up, um, I bought, uh, I bought, um, Revlon. Oh my God, it's time to focus in. Hopefully we focus soon. Anyway, I bought this Revlon. Oh, it's got really not going to focus. Anyway. I bought this Revlon H Ultra HD matte lip colour. There you go. Seriously, I'm not even used to this. <laughs> anyway, I can't even put it closer. Anyway, um, yeah, I, I wish I'd focus. Oh my God, I'm so bad at this. Yeah, there we go. We have we have a solution. Okay, it's Ultra HD matte lip colour. Um, in Seduce, Seduction, Seduction, there you go. Yeah, I've done a... Um, Swatch on my blog. I've left a link in the description by uh, bar box whatever um, for you guys. But yeah, I got that. And with that came a gift of the lip, uh, lip, yeah, lip lip liner. Sort of like like that. I'm loving the nude nails, by the way. Um. Also, I'm not really qualified in on my grade at makeup. But um, I'm getting there, so yeah, I bought this, the balm. Um, 
I like the quirky and vintage um, packaging. It's really cute. I really, I really, when I saw this, I was like, yep, whatever this has got, I'm going to buy. So I'm going to make up. I'm trying again. I'm going to start hopefully doing something about it. But um, so I've got a new makeup palette. So look at the, the names Matt, Matt Johnson, Matt Garcia, Matt Abdul. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty cool names, but they're quirky. So I like them. And yeah, um, they're not testing animals, which is great. Heaps of things here. And yeah, to bought that. And with that came gifts of purchase. If I knew that I was going to get these, I would have bought the red one. But um, I got some. Now, with the photo that I took and for Earth Wilder, the brooch, um, I wore one of the lipsticks from of these lip mattes. It was this one. Let me see. Yeah, this one. So, yeah, meet Matt Hughes. Uh, it's called Loyal. Loyal. Anyway, I'm talking about focus. I'm not really good at this, but I'll get there. Um, yeah, the balm as well. They're really good. I had a coffee and I had biscuits. You know, being naughty, it's having a naughty, naughty cheat day, and. They still didn't come off, but when I took it off with the makeup and the wipe, with the lip for the lips, um, came off straight away. So they're really good. So I've got those. There you go. Some nudes. Need some more nude colors in my life. So I got that. Um, skincare. Um, actually, the other product I was going to show you is in the shower, but um, I can't be bothered getting it to be honest. <laughs> Um, Shea Butter, so Loxitan, um, kindly gave me this, so I'll just open it for you. Um, yeah, Shea Butter, really great for the hands, um, honestly, I will, I'll put this, yeah, on my, on my hands for this one, yeah, I was just thinking of the other product that I had in my hand, this one, but, um, yeah, this one is great for the hands, obviously hand cream. For dry skin, Shea Butter, 20%, so... It's full of natural oils and it's not paraben free and all the good stuff. So I've got that. If you go to my blog, there's um the I had a I've got the Vivine shower gel as well. Shower yeah, shower gel. And also the hundred percent shea butter. So this is shea butter is really great for hydration. So if you've got really dry skin and in, in between months I'll generally get that. So that's that. Um yeah, so I've got 100% shea butter. I use this for like cracked, really cracked lips, you know, in between seasons. Pardon me. Um, sorry, I'm still new to gym gym break. Um, yeah, or my cuticle sometimes, or my elbows, or my knees. I've got like scars on my knees. So I use this. Um, anything really hydrating is good for scars and stuff like that. But shea butter is meant to be really good. So um, yeah, got that. Also, this is now we're going to go into home. So, um, this has been all over Kmart's Instagram. I finally got a hold of the not um, pillowcase. Now, I mean, it doesn't look great, but I bought it because it adds dimension. And it's that blush pink that I'm really obsessed with about the, at the moment. And so I got that just to add a bit of dimension because my, as you can see, my bedding's very plain. So, um, I got that. Oops. And also, let's see, I've got this clock. So, yeah, I've got that. I that was about $30. I don't know if you can see that properly. Anyway, so I've got that. And also, I'm going to take you off the tripod. Back with me. And I've got this blazer. Um, I bought this for obvious reasons. It looks like... Oh man, um, it's a great dupe. I got this from Portman's, um, hundred dollars as opposed to fifty thousand. But anyway, it was good for the pocket. Um, I am obsessed with Balmain jack jackets. The blazer is just the ultimate classic for me, and I find because um, sorry about the lighting. I don't know when it goes on, it looks better, but um, it's got a bit of that cinching waist, so it makes you slimmer. So anyway, it's got the detailing there. I mean, it's single-breasted, but I'm okay with that. Just 
just to throw it on just to keep me nice and warm because like I said we're getting cooler thank god um yeah so I bought white because um as much as my you know uh, um gut was like no get black get black I don't actually I didn't remember seeing black it wasn't very nice it wasn't with a silver hardware well, actually it's not even silver hardware, this is like kind of gold, it's kind of silver, it's kind of in between, it's not really tacky either, which I was really happy about, because some dupes, you know, with they put their silver, or the gold hardware, that's really tacky and bright, but this was really nice, and the rose gold, I didn't get that this month, I got that last month from Target, I'm um, very happy with those. Makes my cupboard looking very chic. Anyway, <laughs> back to the story. Um, yeah, so I got this nice um, Balmain dupe. Um, best one I've seen, to be honest. Um, yeah, so I was like 100 and they had 25% off, so I went down to 75. So that was really great. I was really happy to get that. And I'm going to do a lookbook with this uh, eventually. Hopefully, um, I get a computer soon. Sorry, I keep saying arms. Um, um, don't worry, each sheep is blocked that out. That's why they sound like luminous when they talk. But um, in reality, this is how they sound. They have um in every two seconds. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so when I get a computer and I do, you know, have a laptop, or computer, laptop, whatever, and MacBook Pro, anyway, so I can start doing editing properly and I can do full videos with my DSLR. So I can actually start doing lookbooks and I really want to do a classics one and this will be in it. So. Um, I know I'll be doing a photo shoot. Um, a follower DM'd me asking for photo shoots. She wanted really more work inspo outfits. And I said, I'll do one, you know, one item. Are you okay with that? She said, yes. So I'm going to do it with this. That's my new baby. I love, every now and then I'll get it dirty. Um, just the outerwear. Really just to pop it on top. Make the outfit nice and sophisticated. And, well, it's been elegant and, you know, still corporate as well. So really happy with that. So yeah, that is that is it, I think. Um, nothing more. So I'm gonna take this off. So you guys can see me. Hi. Hello. Sorry. This is my room, by the way. You'll see a lot of me. This is my selfie mirror. Um yeah, so thanks so much for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the haul. Um, like I said, I range from beauty, skincare to home to, you know, um, fashion. So I'll be doing styling as well, which is obviously not in the haul. Just mentioning that. <laughs> I don't know. What's wrong with me today? I think I need some water or coffee. Maybe a coffee. Anyway, um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed that. And let, like I said, give me a comment down below. Tell me what you think. Have you tried any of these products? Have you bought the jacket? Have you got a Balmain jacket? I'd love to hear from you. I really would. So, um, yeah. I'll leave my link. I will link. Let's say it again. I will link my social media, my Instagram as well. I'd love for you guys to follow me. And um, my latest post, if you guys do see this, and my latest post, comment saying, I come from YouTube. And then I'll know. And then you guys came from YouTube, obviously. <laughs> Anyway, I'm going to stop rambling on. I think I need to go have a break. Yeah, <laughs> sounds good. Anyway, guys, don't forget to subscribe and like this video. And let you know, I pl um, quick fact before I leave. I play with my hair when I'm nervous or bored. And obviously, not bored, I'm nervous. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'll see you in my next one. Don't forget to subscribe and tell me what you think. Like I said, if you try these products, you haven't. If you've got a Balmain jacket, if you love blazers, I'd love to hear from you. Anyway, bye guys.